Ooh, talking about video. So, of course, we did get some new news for Global Angel, but of course, Global Angel Pay. Um, we got a new day download, so yeah, we got uh, just a few little stuff here. Nothing like crazy, crazy though, but I'm gonna go for it pretty quick though. And of course, for JP, like I said, Global Angel JP. JP got a new Chan Battle unit. Of course, easy A for going to go 10. Um, lots of little new stuff like that. Um, draws some metal so you can wake him, I guess. I feel like his awakening was already there. The assets for it, anyway. I feel like it was already there. Maybe not for the Dragon Ball story. Well, no, because assets would have been here anyway. I can do to a battle road. That is for the Turtle stage, I think. Or she's with a battle road. They always confuse one. But yeah, I was like, yeah, I have to make them both in one video because there's not that much for with Golden JP. But I still actually do like making, um, you know, thumbnails and everything, of course, you know, or just be pushing two videos into one because it makes editing a lot more easier. I would love them in two different videos, but there's kind of no point sometimes if it's short like this, though. But I usually just talk about the data download or anything like new and anything like the pretty much, honestly, really anything new for Fredoka. Because, of course, we have for Global, the two brand new Easy A's, an LR1, and of course, a regular um, Easy A. I say sub Easy A. Regular uh, LR Easy A, and of course, um, and a regular just LR Easy A and regular LR. I cannot speak today. I've been at work, so yeah. Yeah, for global though, really much it's just like the cell area. Oh, GD is to use, you know, other free play units and stuff like that. Yeah, yeah. Gonna make sure on that later. Android 17's EZA and everything. And of course, tickets so you can, you know, buy, you know, if you want to really just buy EZA tickets, but no one does that anyway. And of course, for JP, they got. Oh, okay. Motion power only is about a road. Okay. Uh, extra soil about a road. Oh, no, just motion power. Oh, no, it is extra soil about a road. Okay. Motion power. Um, that should be pretty easy, though, honestly. With all the EZAs and stuff like that they got in. Um, Gone to go to the EZA, which is weakness is planetary destruction. Um, yeah, just EZA assets. Is there, oh, yes, LR EZA is pretty easy. Yeah, it shows his, um, um, Sword Event logo and everything that's been added. Oh, yeah, Legends has this stuff, though. Because uh, I've read Twitter does recommend um, other um, platforms and everything. Oh, yeah, we got a new cooler in New 17, Dump 13, which looks sick as heck. Um, but yeah, go on Grave Chain Battle. Actually, it looks really nice though. It actually looks like Carter. I think the Grave Battle uh, it is new though. I think they just took that from the, um, I think they just took that from, uh, what was it? My brain right now, I can't even think. The support memory. Where I think they made a whole new asset for that. Well, yeah, they reused re re the same Grave Asset anyway though. But there are little hidden, hidden details and everything in them though. But yeah, like I said, nothing really, really crazy in the day download, though. But I'm going to talk about Cell, of course, 17. Because 17 is, is, isn't that bad, though. Uh, he, he gives out support. He builds himself up. And, I mean, overall, like, from his base form. Yeah, because they really didn't... Well, no, they added a lot. I forgot they did a lot for him. I don't really talk about the EZA cell because, um... I mean, for JP, I mainly just, like, talk about it. Go over it. My full thoughts and opinions on the asset. Like, how the unit is going to work as assets. Um, how the unit's going to be. How, want, um, how I think about, how I think about the unit. I just get my full opinions and thoughts of them. 17 is disgusting though. He's going to be tanking, helping out with support, reducing damage. He's just going to be just... It's almost like having like crit, dodge, and um, um, additional attack in his like um, kit. Like support, helping out allies, like support, supporting himself, reducing damage. It's going to be good. I, I, think, I, think, I think I didn't like this one though. I love the Thieving Six Token Wiki though because they put, put out everything and the card is so clean. So HD, I like it though. And of course, that was art, so it's still amazing. But yes, that was pretty disgusting too, though. But um, I think I got the, like, I was like, yeah, it's kind of like from Jiren though. Like, you had the floor down to fit on status for his crit, which is too reliable. Uh, but I haven't like all my old, older videos. Um, it's somewhere around me because I definitely forgot what I even said back then. Like, I literally forgot even what I said back then about selling um, 17 though. But I thought they were pretty good though. Actually, should I switch it? Eh, it's fine. I'll leave it there. But yeah, I thought they were pretty good though. Uh, like for what, like when they came out and everything. Um, cause, um, I can't think of my head right now. I cannot think right now. I just really can't. Um, yeah, that 17 is going to be really good though, of course, with the Universal Survival Saga. Again, with him, LR17. You can make a whole team Universal Survival Saga LRs. He's gonna be, he's another great addition. His easy is amazing. He's gonna be good for androids too, because he, again, I've seen people run on Android team. He tanks, he's sick. 
He's awesome again. Even Dark Wall Super just fixed 17 for me overall, though. And I loved it. It was beautiful. Awesome. 17 is going to be worth it. Actually, do I have a 17? Yeah, I do have them. I have them. I have like so much of these older Doka Fest now. The newer ones I don't, but I don't care. Because all of them are pretty good. I like them. Like, I like Turles. I like, um. I like, actually I did like Kale, though. I think Kale's pretty good, too. too. Um. Yeah, because I feel like all these Doka Fest kind of like, feel like I'm missing something, too. Like, Turles is good, but I feel like he's missing something. Raditz. Kale, too. Like, they all kind of have, like, that feel of, like, they're missing something. Like, they're disgusting and broken, honestly. Don't get me wrong. But it's also, like, you feel like they're missing something, or. Something doesn't feel right about the unit, though. But yeah, again, with these older EZAs, I was the older Dogo Fest. They're just simple down to the point. Like when they first came out, and when they EZA, they get the better buffs. Some of them have sucked, though. Trust me, like Adrian Gordon Frieza's. I did like his when he first came out. Thought he was pretty disgusting, pretty good. But as the years go on, like he just, he's gonna age. Like he's already probably aged at this point because all these new meta units, like Kale, Super Seventeen. Even though, like you know, Super Seventeen's good though, but once you really start ever up and up with him. He's gonna be tanking, but kind of too late, I guess. Like, we really want him to tank and everything. I mean, but overall, though, I think 17 is a really good addition to the team. Even though, you know, the Universal Survival Saga has so many units. Uh, what are these other categories? Really Rivals, Defender of Justice, Superheroes, Battle of Wits. Yeah, this probably gonna be his best team. This even is Bond. They probably would be. Hey, no, no, these would probably be his best four teams, honestly. The other ones are actually really good, too, though. But, um, and yeah, like, you think they're good. Yeah, you have a lot of just good support on here. Yeah, of course, these guys are on here, too, though, of course. But yeah. Oh, I forgot that 18 did exist. I kind of forgot about that. With the red earrings. But yeah, probably could be, like, the best competitors right there. So, probably the Gamma, too. Not as many links, though, but the Android team can, you know, help out in better ways more than one, though. But, I mean, hey, it, it's good. It's good enough. I like it. I think he's good. Um... Yeah, I feel like Android is universal as well as Saka. He's going to be really good in those categories and teams. I think he's going to be really good. He's worth it. And, um, yeah, I don't need, he's good. Like, he's really good. I don't need to explain it. I, I'll put my full, full breakdown video around me somewhere up above. Um, but yeah, again, he's going to have a lot of good teams. He's going to be amusable. Of course, when his 18 gets her easy, she's going to be insane. But yeah, that's really good too for Androids. And of course, Topo is going to be the main support, though. I mean, but. Overall, though, I mean, like I said, he's not going to link all these guys, because his link sets is mainly with Android 18, but when she gets to EZA, once they probably get EZA in the future, they, need, they definitely need one day, it's just, honestly, I've fallen off. But yeah, you have a lot of good, just like, one, two, three, Krillin can be better, he can be better in the future, but these one, two, three, four, five, like, good competitors. I mean, the other guys are going to be good, too, too, but, I mean, overall... Yeah, it's super tech formable too. So yeah, another good unit though, honestly, down in the books for me. Good EZA. Of course, on the sale, I thought he was amazing. Because again, before he came out, he was hitting some pretty good numbers. Actually, he was pretty strong and powerful, honestly. But now that he has EZA with his support, and his support with his new meta, the you know, supportness, the um, percentage system now. Yeah, because he first came out, if he first came out with this, he would have been insane. Again, like, he's a unit from like 2019, like the beginning of 2019. Yeah. Oh no, he oh no, Rokobe came out in July. Yeah, for guy. Oh, he did. Cut. Yeah, first, of course. Makes sense. Just makes sense, honestly. Because he came out, I think, in like 2019, I think. Like early 2019. Or 2020? When they just started? I can't remember. It's been so long that this all came out. But our virtual platform, of course, can use more of help. I know he's probably not going to be like the best competitor on there because Cooler takes over that team pretty much. But our virtual platform has a whole bunch of units. Um, Android is gonna he's gonna be useful against um, he's gonna be healing with the super attack He's gonna be powering up the super attack lowering attack and defense even though it's not that mandatory But all these hidden units can be really really disgusting and good um, But yeah, he, he supports himself a lot buffing up a super attack healing critting even though it's kind of really not that really eh. I mean, but I mean overall he's still good. So disgusting. Of course we get wait, Yeah, the more higher key you get the more key you get with them. He's gonna be destructive and crazy I mean, but overall, though, I mean, sales not bad either, though. His links are set pretty, is pretty good to it. Uh, Messenger from the future. No, I think it was Shocking Speed, Big Red Bosses, and Shocking Limit, I think. But those, those, those links kind of did suck. He had Big, he had big Red Bosses, and that's disgusting. I use sell so much now. He's insane. Oh, yeah, he's going to go with him. Him. Hey, yeah. Yeah, like, he, so many cells he can link up with. The, the, yeah, like, he's going to be so good. He's, he's going to be insane. Like, 
I just like a whole bunch of other, like more other units. Oh yeah, time travel. I think it's going time travel. Oh, chaos target Goku. So enemies. Uh, yeah, he's gonna be a good hand jump everywhere on his teams. I guess that was amazing. I love him so much. I think he might be like one of my favorite LREs. Yeah, he's like a hidden one. Him and Krillin. I mean, Krillin doesn't have that. I mean, him and Krillin, I think, are attack for me though because. He's probably the best villain, of course, LR, EZA for free to play, and Krillin, I think, is but the best for free to play one we have right now. We is good too, but I mean, nothing beats Cell, like, he's good, like, hit, these two are some really good addition to the Android Steam and slash updates, both good. But yeah, that's really everything I pretty much want to go over, of course, JP went over everything when that first came out and everything, so I don't really need to explain or talk about that, but I mean, I, I mean, it's, it's good, we can champ battle, EZA for them, they're disgusting. Okay, I don't need to change that much though. Like, so Diddy buffed up because of how old now Diddy he was. Maybe he was still kicking on butt though. Not as much though, I mean, but hey, I take that W. But yeah, see you guys later though. Thanks so much for watching. Have a great day. Great. Oh, good again though. Know, stay safe. Watch your hands a couple. Hope you go. Oh, yeah, yeah. Sells a free unit. He's disgusting. But yeah, I wish I have 17 by now. He's been on so many banners. But he's just a whole unit in general. But yeah, see you guys later though. Thanks so much for watching. Have a great day. Great. Oh, good again though. Stay safe. Watch your hands a couple. Oh, we go. Oh, but I'm mad. Don't tell people what we do. Yes, if you can, of course, I just got some copy. I'm sure my friend Discord social is freaking great. That's awesome. So, we got to take a ball into the of course, and hit it again. Very simple, very easy, like I said, though. Um, like I said, not that much to the download, but you got some really good units in here, and they're going to be cracking up Duke into 11 with their Android, the Android buff and everything. So, so many categories. 17 is going to be really good. Overall, as a unit, pretty much like I said, the new units came out nowadays. They probably be like this, but that's worth it. Of course, got on the go to talk about them in my other video. So much dope news. See you guys later, though. Uh,